Ahead of King Charles' coronation next month, Good Morning Britain asked viewers if they were proud to be English. They welcome guests Nur Indicor and Thomas Skinner to give their opinion on the debate but things quickly became heated. Narenda raged there was nothing to be proud of and when Ed Balls disagreed, she branded him ignorant. Narenda commented, you know we should have national pride, I feel Englishmen and women should feel proud. But we can't feel proud when that flag has been hijacked by far-right groups and what it actually represents is ideology that by some virtue of a piece of cloth, we are superior to other nations. We conveniently forget our history of slavery links, of colonization and history of genocide and everything we've built up and most countries that celebrate Independence Day, and I've seen a lot of people on social media say well Ireland celebrated and America celebrated, they celebrate because they're celebrating coming out of tyranny or invasion. England were the oppressors, they were the suppressors, England have nothing to celebrate because they suppressed half the world and somehow they suffer from this Napoleon complex. Ed cut into commented, by the way, we did save Europe from fascism by defeating Hitler and pushing him back, with the help of others. But Narenda wasn't impressed with his comment as she hit back, it doesn't really work like that. Don't miss. Rose Ailing Ellis shares King's lovely gesture ahead of coronation, interview, Yellowstone's Kaylee Riley shares tribute to colleague on new show, latest, take a look inside the life of bargain hunts Natasha Raskin Sharp, insight, it doesn't work like that because you're saying, well we stopped that, but that doesn't mean we didn't have slavery links. As Ed insisted he was proud England helped defeat the Nazis. The GMB guest continued, it's not the same because you're being ignorant dead because Terry's ignorance in that. You're saying, well we saved everyone from fascism, we did do that, however, we should also acknowledge how much genocide and colonialism and theft has gone in this country. You said there was nothing to be proud of in this country and to be English and I said, when France was occupied and America was out of the war, we stood alone and pushed back fascism and stooped oppression across Europe. Narenda wasn't impressed with Ed and claimed he was using that example to forget England's history as a whole. As the debate became incredibly heated, Susanna had to set in to defuse the clash. She interrupted, but Narenda, are you saying, and Thomas, sorry I know you're quietly sort of waving your street. George's flag. Narenda are you saying because the UK, England, was responsible for things we should be ashamed, that we should be permanently ashamed? Not permanently but I don't like this fingers in ears and blowing raspberries so what, we actually defeated fascism, she hit back. I don't like that. Susanna pushed back, no but clearly Ed is not putting his fingers in his ears. Good Morning Britain airs weekdays on ITV from 6am. i